Just three months left for your PU2 boards. Do you want to top PU2 boards? Don't kill your dreams. That you actually have a strategy, a secret strategy. I am telling you, you should not do that. Rather, you should prioritize the high weightage topics. And we have done this with the help of the past five year paper analysis. A very big hello to my wonderful PU2 champions. I hope all of you are doing absolutely great. So, what's up? Just three months left for your PU2 boast and I'm pretty sure all of you might be having mixed feelings. Lot of things to study. Um, your school journey is going to end and how well will I actually perform in PU2, right? Because we all know the importance of it. It is one of the qualifying examination for getting admission into the top colleges out there. It is going to decide your eligibility to write some big, big entrance exams. So yes, it is important. And now the next question comes, do you remember the first day when you walked into this grade? I'm pretty sure everyone has this. Once they enter a new grade, they think that this is my year. I will definitely do well this year. So were you actually able to achieve whatever you thought of? Some of you might say yes, kudos to you. Some of you might have went into thinking phase. Well, my dear children, if you were not able to achieve, understand one very important thing. Your journey has not ended yet. You still have time. These three months are going to be precious. Make sure you use it nicely and we are here to help you with that. Okay? So I want to ask you a question again. Do you want to top PU2 boards? Don't kill your dreams. Okay? Do you want to top PU2 boards? Let me know in the comment section. Yes or no? Some of you might be thinking, ma'am, I do not know whether it's actually easy or difficult to crack in PU2, to get the best scores out there. Well, I say it depends on how you look at the bigger picture. So we all know about the glass, which is half filled story, right? Some of you might say, oh, it's just half filled. And the, on the other hand, some might think it's at least half filled. We just have to fill the other half. So it depends upon how you look and how you approach things. You should have a strategy in your head. Then everything becomes easy. And what if I tell you that you actually have a strategy, a secret strategy? What if you focus on the high weighted chapters? Ma'am, this is what everyone says. We have to focus on high weighted chapters, high weighted chapters. Yes, I have also said that, that you should be focusing on high weighted chapters. That does not mean you should be leaving the low weighted chapters, but you should be giving more priority to them. However difficult they seem, you have to complete them. But it is not just about high weighted chapters, my dear children. You should understand that in a chapter also, there are certain things which usually comes. So when we revise a chapter, what do we do? We revise the entire thing with the equal energy. I am telling you, you should not do that. Rather, you should prioritize the high weightage topics. There are topics which repeats every single time or there are topics that usually comes. Please give more preference to it while you revise, while you study. It is going to help you out. And where do you find these topics from? We have done this for you already. Okay, and we have done this with the help of the past five year paper analysis. So all teachers separately sat with the papers, they made the high listed topics and I am going to present that over here. But before I go ahead, if at all you are ready for this, if at all you think that whatever happened happened, now I am going to give my best. I want you to type this in the comment section. From today, 100%. From today, you're aiming for 100%. Okay, I really want you to do that and type it with determination. Okay? So, the first subject that we have is chemistry. This is the chapter wise weightage from high to low. And now we are going to go ahead with the topic wise thing. So in this chapter that is solutions, the one that is marked in darker shade of yellow, the brighter shade of yellow, such as colligative properties, it has given two questions this year, two questions the previous year, and three questions before that. So we know that it is super important. So while we revise, we have to give priority to this one. Then the next priority to concentration terms, the one which is in lighter shade of yellow. 
So one, 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 almost three questions have been coming up from this topic which is there. Now next priority, solubility and ideal and not ideal thing. Okay? And then next priority should be given to vapor pressure. So these things should be done in accordance with their priority. You should not be aimlessly studying things. So you study whatever you want to study in a chapter, understand it properly, but while you revise, give them the most priority. The same thing goes for the next chapter, that is electrochemistry. Over here, my dear children, you have nurse equation and conductance, which is being repeated the most. And then electrolytic cell and batteries, and then galvanic cells and corrosion. Okay, so prioritize them in order. Cool. And if you want the PDF, you can let us know in the comment section. We can make the PDF available to you guys as well. Now, chemical kinetics over here, this chapter is super important. As you can see, this has given, okay, so integrated rate equation, temperature and CT. This has the repeated questions the most. And then rate of chemical reaction and factors that is there, catalyst which is there. These are the topics that you have to cover. Okay. Now we go to the next chapter, D and F log. The most important one is some important compounds and actinoids. This one you have to cover first, then the other ones which are being marked. Cool, go in this order. There are 10 chapters, right? So chapter number five, coordination compounds, isomerism, bonding theory, the most important, then bonding in metal carbonyls, then Werner's theory, and then important terms, nomenclature, and all of this that is coming up. First, these things. Now going ahead, haloalkanes and haloarenes, SN1 and SN2, the most important, then um, haloalkanes and prep of haloarenes, this has to be done. So reactions and the prep. Cool, and over here classification comes to be the next. No, before that we have polyhalogen compounds, which is also important, then comes classification. Okay, so all of this is made by teachers themselves, so this is made by Ashwarya ma'am. Chapter number seven, alcohols, phenols, and ethers. My dear, spelling of ethers is wrong, do not mind. So over here, you have classification to be the first one, which is important. Then prep of alcohols, prep of phenols, and alcohols again. Over here, uh, nomenclature is also important. Uh, and then phenols, and then ethers, this is also important. Please go through it, okay? I'm assuming REC is for reactions. I'm assuming that. Chapter number eight, aldehydes, ketones, and carboxylic acid. Reactions of ketones is the one that is most important. Then prep of acids, then reactions of acids. And as the list goes on, you have to follow it. Going ahead with the next set of things, that is chapter number nine, amines. Classification and prep of amines is the most important. Then reactions of amines, then nomenclature and basicity, my dear children. Going ahead with biomolecules, which is the last chapter, carbohydrates, the most important one, then vitamins and nucleic acid, and then hormones, and then proteins. Okay, the trend might change, but at least you have an idea of what is more important, what you have to focus more. Now, I'm pretty sure you might have got an idea that, yes, we have worked on it, and that's how we have come up with this conclusion. And my dear children, why do you think we, do, we are doing it? So that you score well. And please understand that we are working really, really hard and we are planning to do something big for you. We are really, really working hard and if at all, and this is not uh, for us, it's for you guys, for you guys to score 95 percentage and above. That's the aim. So that you can follow this and score really, really well, give your best and show everyone how much capable you are, okay? And if at all you have any guesses of what we are actually planning, you can put that also down in the comment section. Let us see, do you know our idea or is it something that is not being predictable at all? But please have the trust in us that we will be bringing up something really, really important for you, something really, really good for you, and you can make the best use of it. And you can score 95 percentage and above with that, yeah? Okay, so don't be sad about anything, okay? Now going ahead with the next subject, physics. Over here you have these many chapters out there. I have arranged it chapter-wise. And over here, Coulomb's law, properties of electric field lines are the most important one. Then comes electric field application. Then Gauss's law, electric field due to long straight wire, electric field due to spherical shell. And then comes electric field due to dipole two position. Chapter number two, electrostatic potential and capacitance. The most important one is parallel plate capacitor. Then potential energy application and relation between E and V. Then comes these three topics. And the next, next set of topics are the ones which are not marked in colors. Okay? 
going ahead with the next chapters, I will be moving a bit faster because you know where so many of them are there. Current electricity, my dear children, over here, the topics which have been highlighted are super, super important. As you can see, they have been repeated so many times, right? So they are important. Then comes current and current density. Moving charges and magnetism, these are the topics which are super important. Emitter and voltmeter conversion, Ampere's law, force between two parallel current carrying. And then, my dear children, comes all this thing. That is Lorentz force, motion of a charge in a motion of a charge in a magnetic field, all the other terms. This is chapter four. Going ahead with the next one, chapter number five, magnetism and matter. Paramagnet, diamagnet, ferromagnet is the first one which is important. Then magnetization, magnetic permeability and susceptibility. Then Gauss's law of magnetism and then this particular topic. Electromagnetic induction, these three topics are super important. Then comes motional electromotive force and then comes Faraday's call, ma coil magnet experiment. Now, four, seven chapter, alternating current, these two topics are the one which are super, super important. Please go through it. Fine. Now, we have chapter number eight, electromagnetic waves. These two topics, again, super, super important. Then comes speed of light. Ray optics and optical instruments, uh, this is super important. Snell's law is super important. Then comes telescope, microscope. Then comes lens maker's formula, refractive index of prism, and then sign convention. Chapter number 10, wave optics. These are the topics which are super important, which have been marked in yellow. Then comes the other ones which are not marked. Dual nature of radiation and matter. Again, uh, photoelectric effect observation, photoelectric equation and terms. That is important. Then comes particle nature, de Broglie wavelength, and then photoelectric effect, Einstein's explanation. Chapter number 12, atoms. These two topics, super important. Chapter number 30, nuclei, binding energy of mass effect, super important. Then nuclear force, isotopes, isotones, and isobars, and then all the other topics out there. Semiconductor electronics. These three topics, super important. Then comes P and N type semiconductors. Okay? My dear children, do you think it is helpful for you? As I said, if it is helpful, let us know. And do you need any more help? Let us know that as well. So it's not like you just have to tell if it is helpful or not. You also can tell us what help do you need. So do you need model papers first or do you need question bank answers? What is something that you're needing as of now? We can make it available to you. Okay, so please let us know that as well. Mathematics, my dear children, these are the chapters arranged chapter wise and according to the weightage. Topic wise, if you go relations and functions, types of relation, inverse of a function, highest important topics, then composite function and then types of function and then the number of functions. Inverse trigonometric functions, my dear children, these two topics super important and then comes the simplest form. Okay. Matrices, product of matrices, transpose of matrix and properties of a matrix are the super important topics, then number of matrix, then formation of a matrix. Determinants, as you can see, it's totally yellow. The topics which are being marked has been created by him, has been put down by him. So I think all of them are super important. Okay? Now, do not worry about, uh, do not worry about if at all I am not able to speak about a topic. The respective teachers would also be making separate video explaining it to you a lot, lot better. But this is a cumulative video for all the subjects so that you know the highest important topics or the high weightage topics out there. Okay, so do not judge me for that. The continuity and differentiability, uh, you have continuous function and all the other things. Differentiable function comes to be the next priority. Okay, so these the ones that are marked or on super priority, the next priority is given to this one. Now, application of derivatives, my dear children, maxima and minima of a function, that is first. Increasing and decrease function, that is also super important. Both of these topics, super important. Then comes rate of change of a function. Now, going ahead, uh, we have integrals, as you can see. The ones that are colored, super important. Then comes the next one. Application of integrals, you have area enclosed by ellipse, which is the one. And then area, you do not have much questions coming up. So this is the one that is super important and then followed by the ones which have been coming up. I think that marks the end of it. No, no. Differential equations, you have these many topics which are super important. Vector algebra, my dear children, over here, these topics. And then comes angle between two vectors and also basic definition of a vector. 3D geometry, all the three ones and then these two topics which are there. 
linear programming definitions and graphical method as you can see uh, both of them are equally important in one year two questions in one year two questions again so yes you can expect some questions coming around from these topics probability which is the end of it okay so over here you have three chapter uh, three topics which are super important and then comes independent events and union of intersection of events that is second priority now for my wonderful biology champions this is made by me only so now i can talk a lot about it but i would not obviously because there are no more much biology children and i'll make it a separate as a separate video as well but i can give you a hint of the most important topics here itself so chapter wise arrangement has been done topic wise if you see my dear children sexual reproduction and flowering plants these are the topics which have come and i've made sure i put how many marker so one marker question have come from this one marker question have come from this so i've marked the marks also so that you know okay so pollination and its type super important features of uh, flower pollinated by wind and examples super important apomixis and polyembryony super important structure of pollen grain also important but at the other hand you have also got five marker question from this topic five marker question coming from double fertilization and things like that so depending on that you can go ahead so five marker if it is there please make sure you are going ahead with those topics as well okay so they might have not been repeated much but they have given you so in biology you can see topics coming off from different different places right it's a it is theory related subject so human reproduction my dear children these to menstrual cycle and hormones and gestation and parturition this has come so many times and then spermatogenesis and as you can see you can follow these things so five marker questions have come with the structure and diagram and things like that cool now reproductive health these two contraceptive methods and iud's in contraceptive methods iud is also super important because you have got separate questions based on that and uh, the other ones i have marked them accordingly so depending upon the weightage please prioritize these topics principles of inheritance and variation these are the three topics which have usually been repeated so many times and if at all you are looking for five marker that also is been mentioned cool as i said you can get the pdf do not be worried about it molecular basis of inheritance these three topics salient features of human genome transcription and transcription unit discovery of the genetic material these three topics super super important and then comes the other topics out there evolution the ones that i have marked hardy weinberg principle and factors affecting it evolution of a man evolution by anthropogenic action that is natural selection and things like that okay so anthropogenic action as a man made thing for example not natural selection that is uh, we have studied about uh, the what do you call the moth right the moth so that is an example for this okay so i have uh, okay my biology teacher version is coming out so i won't discuss much so human health and disease this topic is the one which has been repeated most of the times but as i said i have marked the ones which have come in one marker two marker five marker so five marker things should not be missed as well okay microbes in human welfare these are the topics other five markers wherever you see please refer to them also this thing why i have marked is that they have repeated consecutively that is why i have marked them now biotechnology principle and processes it looks like this these three topics super super important other topics have also come biotechnology and application use of genetically modified plants have come so many times benefits of transgenic animals has also come go accordingly now organism and population population interactions have come so many times so make sure you're going through it properly and ecosystem steps of decomposition construction of ecological uh, ecological pyramid that has come so many times so go through them properly and then you can refer to the other topics biodiversity and conservation which marks the end of biology my dear children in situ and ex situ conservation most repeated and causes of biodiversity lo losses the evil quadrant is also being asked most of the times okay so with that we end this particular video but i think it was useful for you and as i said something big is coming we are working really really hard for it you can keep guessing on what exactly it is but i can i can guarantee you one thing that it is going to give you 95 percentage plus marks out there so be ready for it stay tuned for it and keep guessing lots of love and keep working hard do not give up you can do it you will do it Okay so bye bye take care